Hey planner peeps, it's Jessica. Today I'm going to be doing another personal size plan with me. I'm still in my recollections planner from Michaels and this will be my second week using the So Much Crafting inserts week on two page vertical style. This was my last week. I used a Little Miss Papery kit and it was so cute. I really enjoyed it. So I'll pull out this current week. Now, I saw Kiera on Paper Princess Plans use some leftovers from a kit that she had. So I thought that was a great idea. I set up my Erin Condren's notes page with a full kit. And so I have a lot of leftovers. And I really thought it was a pretty kit, so I think I could use it, definitely, the leftovers, when we have a just week on two page here. So I have Planner Bell Press, Bloom's kit, and I have leftover ombre heart checklist, some checklists and some stitched labels. These are the full boxes that I have left. I have quite a bit of half boxes, labels, some icons, little flags. I have some sidebars, some half box stitch labels, icons. I have the weekend banner and all the headers and some littles and then this is the washi strip page so this is really pretty and I'm excited to get to use it again so I also went ahead and pulled out this washi it is by recollections comes in the tube with all the really cool sayings and the gold foiling I thought this color would look nice I hope that the words aren't too distracting but I really want to use it so this is what I'm going to be using to run along the sides here. Um, that's kind of the tedious part I feel. I run it along and then I trim off the extra and I punch it. So I'll probably go ahead and start that process and then poke back in with you guys. Okay, so I finished with the washi and I punched my holes. I'm not sure you could see what it says anymore, but it did say make today beautiful. I really like it, and hopefully it goes well with the kit. I do have a few special things happening this week. On Monday, I am going to attend an award ceremony at my son's school. My son has way achieved the reading goal this year, so I'm very, very proud of him. On Friday is the first grade graduation, and this Saturday is my 11-year wedding anniversary. So a lot of exciting things happening this week. I think I'm going to set up my layout like I did last week, starting off in this little sidebar section, and then kind of just going day by day. I think I would like to use this Do It On The Daily habit tracker, which is awesome because I can list a ton of different things in a small space. And I'm just going to set that right up at the top, as close as I could get it to the top, I think. I think I might have done that crooked, but my experience with so much crafting is they're not typically removable without, yeah, ripping the premium paper. So I'm gonna leave it as is. Okay, because below there I would like to put one of these half box checklists and maybe I could help even it out. Maybe I could take a little header or something. I can make this my little things. I'll see if we could straighten this out a little bit. Okay, well that's about as good as it's going to get and I'm okay with that. So <laughs> let's move on to Monday. Monday is my big cleaning day in the house. I usually have a lot of chores to catch up on. So I'm going to take the Too Clean header and then I'm going to put that above one of the ombre full checklists.
Now for the award ceremony, I'm going to take one of these little stitched labels from the kit and then I am going to take a little icon that I saw in here. Let's see. This little fast food icon because I am able to sign my son out early from school after the award ceremony if his attendance has been good, which it has been. So I'm going to take him out to somewhere to eat, his choice, because of his academic achievement. So I think I'm all done with my Monday. Let's move to Tuesday. On Tuesday, I'm going to be mostly doing filming, so I'm going to take a decorative full box. And then below there, I will go ahead and put one of these half boxes in. And there I could just write everything that I ended up filming. And I actually have a really cute little icon by Planner Bell Press on a separate page. These little laptops, Kawaii laptops, they're so cute. So I will put one of those in here for my filming time. Let me zoom you guys in just a little bit more. Okay, so for Wednesday, that's kind of like my midweek me time day. So where I try to kind of do something that I want, I'm going to take this really cute coffee break. I think that's super cute. And then below that, I could put a label and write whatever I decided to do as my activity. I think I still want to give myself a little spot to list any other things that I'm going to do. I can't just veg the whole day away. I think I'm going to stick with a blue theme and just put a, well I want to put a half bot of this little checklist down so I think I'll put that first at the bottom and then I'll put this blue to do header above it. Okay, so Thursday. Thursday I'm gonna do some more filming. So I'm gonna put a full box down, kind of repeat what I did on Tuesday. I'm gonna take a half box, and then I will grab out another one of the little laptop icons. On Friday, I usually try to catch up on some things before everybody's home for the weekend so I'm gonna give myself a full to-do list so I'm gonna take to-do header and then a full checklist and then I think I also am going to go ahead and put down one of these little cute flagged stitch labels because we are going to attend the graduation ceremony I'm just going to place that down there so that I can write that in. So for the weekend section, Saturday and Sunday, I think I'm going to go ahead and take the washi strip page and take some of this really pretty floral washi so that I could kind of place my weekend banner. Well, let me look at the weekend banner in the kit, actually. It looks like this. So maybe I want the washi to kind of poke right below it. Let's see where. That means I should probably place it. Maybe I'll just bring it down like about here. Hopefully that'll work. Oops. That was my phone. Sorry if you heard that. I forgot to turn it off. Okay, and let's place the weekend banner down. Cute! I like it. So Saturday is my 11 year wedding anniversary. So I am going to take these little happy anniversary stickers by It's Planning Time. This one goes really nicely. It's kind of like that coral color. And coral was one of my wedding colors, so I like that. And I'll put it down in Saturday. I love it. And then I think what I'll do is take a half box and 
That way I could write down where we go for our date night. Perfect. So on Sunday, my big to-do really is to upload my plan with me. So I'm going to kind of just fill up the day with some more of this pretty washi. And then I'm going to take this really pretty, let's see, what color do I want to do? Maybe I'll do blue because I'm going to use this plan, plan, plan. Just super cute. Just place them next to each other. So my plan with me gets uploaded and then I just like to make sure to post on my Facebook page and post on to Instagram as well. But I think my week is all full guys to be honest. You guys are really close so maybe I'll zoom you back out a little bit. So here's my full week and I really like the way that it turned out. It was a great way to use up some extras because I really did enjoy this blooms kit. So let me go ahead and grab my planner. And we could pop these inserts back in place. And while I'm doing that, I just wanted to mention the kit that I used was by Planner Bell Press. And I do have a 25% off your order coupon code listed down below in the description box if you want to check that out along with some other coupons and info. If you have any questions or suggestions, go ahead and leave them down below in the comments because I always enjoy reading them. And until I see you guys again, have a beautiful day. Bye-bye.